the land and the bison. The story of the Yellowstone Bison Revival begins with the establishment of the park itself. Yellowstone National Park, founded in 1872, is the first national park in the world and has played a crucial role in the conservation of bison. Despite the creation of the park, bison numbers continued to dwindle due to poaching and other human activities. By 1902, only about two dozen bison remained in the park. Recognizing the dire situation, the U.S. government and conservationists took action to save the remaining bison. In 1902, the Army, which was responsible for managing Yellowstone at the time, initiated a program to protect and increase the bison population. They established a bison ranch in the Lamar Valley, where they could closely monitor and breed the animals. This effort marked the beginning of a long and challenging journey towards bison restoration. One of the most significant steps in the revival of the Yellowstone bison was the introduction of bison from private herds to bolster the park's population. In 1907, 21 bison from the Pablo Allard herd in Montana were transported to Yellowstone. These new arrivals were crucial in increasing genetic diversity and boosting the overall population. Over the next few decades, additional bison from other private herds were introduced to the park. The management and conservation efforts of the early 20th century laid the foundation for the resurgence of the Yellowstone bison. By the 1930s, the bison population in the park had grown to several hundred individuals. However, the road to recovery was not without its challenges. Disease outbreaks, particularly brucellosis, posed a significant threat to the bison population. Brucellosis is a bacterial infection that can cause abortions in pregnant females, significantly impacting reproduction rates. To combat the spread of brucellosis and other diseases, park managers implemented various strategies, including vaccination programs and the culling of infected individuals. These measures, combined with ongoing efforts to protect and restore bison habitat, helped stabilize the population. By the 1960s, the Yellowstone bison population had grown to over a thousand individuals. The revival of the Yellowstone bison is not just a story of numbers. It's also about the restoration of a keystone species to its natural habitat. Bison play a crucial role in the Yellowstone ecosystem. As large grazers, they influence vegetation patterns and provide habitat for a variety of other species. Their grazing helps maintain the health of grasslands, promoting biodiversity and preventing the encroachment of woody plants. Bison also have cultural and historical significance for many Native American tribes. For centuries, bison were a vital resource for indigenous peoples, providing food, clothing, shelter, and tools. The near extinction of bison had profound impacts on Native American communities. Today, the revival of bison populations, including those in Yellowstone, is seen as a symbol of cultural and ecological resilience. Despite the successes in bison conservation, challenges remain. One of the most contentious issues is the management of bison that migrate out of Yellowstone National Park. Each winter, some bison move to lower elevations outside the park in search of food. This migration brings them into conflict with livestock interests, as bison can transmit brucellosis to cattle. This has led to the controversial practice of culling bison that leave the park to prevent the spread of the disease. Efforts to address this issue include the development of a quarantine program, where bison are held and tested for brucellosis before being relocated to other conservation areas or tribal lands. This program aims to expand bison populations while minimizing conflicts with livestock. Additionally, there are ongoing discussions about creating more habitat corridors that allow bison to migrate freely without coming into contact with cattle. Another significant challenge is the genetic health of the Yellowstone bison herd. While the population has rebounded, the genetic diversity of the herd is still a concern. Genetic diversity is crucial for the long-term survival and adaptability of the species. Conservationists and geneticists are working together to ensure that the Yellowstone bison maintain a healthy level of genetic variation. This includes careful management of breeding and potential introductions of bison from other genetically diverse herds. In conclusion, the revival of the Yellowstone bison is a remarkable conservation success story. Through careful management, scientific research, and collaboration, these iconic animals have been brought back from the brink of extinction. While challenges remain, the future looks promising for the Yellowstone bison. Their continued presence in the park is a symbol of hope and a reminder of the importance of preserving our natural heritage.